All right, this is a short, condensed video of all the mods I've done to my Hawk. Pilot all into one video. Okay, a little word on performance. If you're going to redo the exhaust, you need to rejet the carbs and uh, open up the uh, air intake. Unipod filters work great for that. You will have to rejet Horde Power, H O R D Power.com. That guy knows the most. Go check that website out for the stuff that you need. The uh, Super Trap headers, they don't make those anymore, but uh, I'm glad to have them. And then the uh, Taiga Maggot Can. Taiga Performance makes this can. It's a 50 millimeter can. It is the loudest exhaust that they make for the Hawk. Up here also by Taiga is the Taiga Carbon Fiber Front Fender. When you take the original fender off, you'll have to use the original fork brace. And you might have to open up the holes a little bit on the side so that it'll fit in, but uh, it really wasn't that big of a deal. A little word on uh, illumination. The uh, turn signals on here I only have in the rear. Uh, you have to do incandescent. LED lights don't work. Trust me, I tried. This is the rear fender removal kit. Uh, you will know that the rear fender is rather large. This just bolts into place. But remember that when you do this type of stuff, you have to illuminate your license plate or you're going to get pulled over by the cops and nobody likes that. Now, a word on some other things. The seat cover that you're looking at right now is made by a guy on the Hawk Forum called Fabian. So do a search on that. Uh, I did get some Hawk paint off the internet through a little sleuthing and uh, it works nice. You have to paint all these parts. The other one is this uh, this rear tire cover that they call the hugger and it also gets rid of the stock chain guard. Well you get rid of the stock chain guard then what are you going to do with the rear brake line? Well they have this mod called the through the swing arm brake line reroute and it goes in through there and it comes out over here And mine is set to come out right there, but some people actually bring it through that orange, uh, those that oval rubber grommet right there. Um, the choice is yours. Honda VTR 1000 handlebars. They work absolutely excellent. You can get them used on eBay for not that much money. You will have to grind this peg down so it'll sit flush, and also underneath on the inside of this housing there is another peg. You'll have to drill a hole where you want this to go on the handlebar so that it'll clamp down properly. That's the only thing that you have to do to these. And in case you're wondering, these are CRG mirrors, the small ones, and they're convex, but you get used to them real quick. Let's just back up and take a look here. Okay, those frame sliders right there, those are also from the Hawk Forum. They do them in small batches, so get them when they're available. You don't want to lay your Hawk down and wreck that tank. Alright. That's it. Be safe out there.